Geb, the ancient Egyptian god of the earth, was a powerful and revered deity. He was often depicted as a man lying on the ground, his body covered in the rich, fertile soil of the Nile River Valley. Geb was the son of the sky goddess Nut and the air god, Shu. He was also the brother and husband of the sky goddess Nut, and together they were the parents of Osiris, Isis, Seth, and Nephthys. Geb's connection to the earth made him the perfect guardian of the land, and he was responsible for ensuring its fertility and abundance. One of the most famous stories about Geb involved a feud between his children, Osiris and Seth. Osiris was a wise and just ruler who taught the people of Egypt how to cultivate the land and live in harmony. Seth, on the other hand, was a jealous and destructive god who sought to usurp Osiris' throne. Seth hatched a plan to kill Osiris and take over the throne of Egypt. He tricked Osiris into getting into a beautiful chest which he then sealed and threw into the Nile River. When Isis, Osiris's loving sister and wife, learned of this, she was devastated. She searched tirelessly for the chest and, with the help of her sister Nephthys, eventually found it. Isis and Nephthys managed to revive Osiris temporarily, and during this time, he and Isis conceived a child, Horus. However, Osiris could not remain among the living and he eventually passed into the realm of the dead, becoming the ruler of the afterlife. Geb, as the god of the earth, played a crucial role in the resurrection and ascension of Osiris to the throne of the underworld. He provided a resting place for Osiris's body and ensured the continued fertility of the land. The story of Geb, Osiris, and Seth is a central myth in Egyptian mythology, emphasizing the importance of the earth's fertility and the eternal cycle of life, death, and rebirth. It also underscores the enduring power of Geb as the guardian of the land and the earth's essential role in Egyptian culture and religion.